Welcome guys to my review for the Lego Movie video game. Before I get started, I just want to thank the folks at G2PO.com and Gamersgate.com for making this review possible. Uh, they're the ones that provided me a copy of this game to review for you guys, so definitely want to thank them and uh, just really, really grateful for this opportunity. Now, some of you guys out there might be a little bit cautious for this game, mainly because some of you might be a little bit overwhelmed uh, because there seems to be a lot of different LEGO games coming out uh, in the past few years. Um, but I want to just kind of talk about this game on why you shouldn't be worried, why you shouldn't be concerned. And again, you, you look at the game, the title, it's a game based on the movie. And more often than not, that's usually not a good sign. Well, fortunately, for both cases, there's a lot of LEGO games coming out. This is a new one, of course, and this is based on the LEGO movie. Is this game worth your time? That's what I'm going to talk about in this review today. First off, in the game, you play this character by the name of Emmett, just this average everyday Joe. In a short amount of time, you realize that your destiny is much greater than you would ever realize. Now, for those of you that have played the past LEGO games, you're going to feel right at home. There's a whole lot of uh, building, a whole lot to unlock and uncover in the game. There's a lot of different stages for you guys to check out. There's a really just excellent pacing to the Lego Movie video game. You're going to really enjoy these different levels that are going to be coming your way and all the different characters that you're going to have the chance to play with. I was really just impressed. I was really, really impressed with the nice level of detail. The visuals in the game are actually really, really good. You have the chance uh, to go it alone, uh, and you of course you have the AI partner that you can switch between uh, to be able to access different levels in the game. You can also play this game uh, with a local second player co-op player, which can be a whole lot of fun. The LEGO video games uh, have been known for, for excellent, excellent two-player action, but as I mentioned earlier, uh, this is for a two-player local co-op only. There's a lot of excellent actors that lend their voices to this game. I was really interested in this story, and from start to finish, it took me about eight to nine hours to complete. But yeah, as I mentioned, there's a lot of voice actors that lend their talent to the game. And guys, this game is downright hilarious in some moments. Um, <laughs> now, first off, I just want to say that this game without you know the hilarious jokes is a great game but the excellent writing and the hilarious jokes kind of like take it over the top i found myself in many cases playing throughout this game you know the the comedic timing is so excellent and and just i just had a blast playing through this game this game has just such excellent uh, character. There's so much to do in this game. Now, as I mentioned, it took about eight or nine hours for me to complete the game from start to finish, and um, the control and the controls in the gameplay are top-notch. Um, the folks that are responsible for this game, they've, they've made themselves a whole lot of different LEGO games, and they seem to just continue to refine themselves. You know, I've, I've been playing the LEGO video games ever since, uh, the Star Wars and, you know, Indiana Jones and, and Batman, and they seem to just kind of refine themselves and, and make these games more and more fun. I don't know, I just had a blast playing through this game. Now, after you're done completing uh, the campaign, you know, you can really actually take your time with this one because you have the free play mode uh, well, where you'll be able to go back with different characters uh, that you've been able to unlock. And that is the way that you're going to be able to get 100% in the game. One of the things I didn't quite like uh, was the fact uh, I was kind of felt a little bit misled in the terms of with this game and what it offered. You know, uh, it was advertised on how you'd be able to play uh, around 90 different characters, which is great. There is a lot of different characters to choose from. However, uh, one of the problems I found was a lot of these characters that I was unlocking uh, were just different costumes uh, for Emmett. There were great characters that I had a lot of fun with, whether it be uh, Abraham Lincoln or a construction worker that just tosses dynamite at various uh, objects to make them explode. Actually, I had a lot of fun with that, but I felt kind of like 
like you know wasn't quite 90 90 characters that you could check out like it was it was more like uh like 70 or 80 characters uh but these but some of these characters had a lot of doubles Overall, guys, I really recommend that you check out the Lego Movie video game. I had a blast playing through this one. I know there's down the road a lot of games to check out, but I was pleasantly surprised at how much fun I had with this game. And, and guys, I highly recommend that you check it out when you get the chance. If you have any questions or comments about this game, definitely leave uh, those in the section below. And if you like this review, definitely hit that thumbs up button. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you later.